Hey, hey, Brian Sensei here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Copilot on your mobile device so you can access generative AI features on the go. Let's check it out. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is head on over to the App Store or the Play Store, depending on your device. Then we're going to search for Copilot. There we go. All right, so here is Copilot. You can see here that I've already installed it, so I'm going to go ahead and open the app. All right, and here we are. Okay, down at the bottom, you will notice that it says use ChatGPT4. I recommend turning this on so that you can leverage the latest and greatest of ChatGPT. Notice here that if we sign in, we can ask more questions and have longer conversations. Now, to begin talking to Copilot, you can use speech to text, or you can type in your text by switching over to the keyboard. I like to use speech to text, so I'm going to go ahead and click on the microphone. I'm going to be performing at an upcoming recital at my rock school, and I need to find a good punk rock song to perform. Can you help me? Absolutely. I'd be glad to help you pick out a punk rock song for your recital. Here are a few classic punk rock songs that are popular and might make a great choice for your performance. Blitzkrieg Bop by The Ramones. Anarchy in the UK by Sex Pistols. London Calling by The Clash. Basket Case by Green Day. Should I Stay or Should I Go by The Clash. All right. You notice I pressed down there at the bottom of the screen to stop the read aloud. But this is great. Look at these great ideas that I've been given for my punk rock recital. And I love how she wraps it up with rock on and the rock and roll emoji. Okay, here we have some ads and we also have some links at the bottom, which are some sources of information. So I could dig into those to learn more. And at the very bottom, I have suggested questions or commands that I could perform here just by tapping on them. But what I want to do is ask another question. Can you help me find a easy punk rock song that is easy to play and only three chords? Certainly. Punk rock is known for its straightforward and energetic style, often using simple chord progressions. Here's a classic punk rock song that's easy to play and typically uses just three chords. Blitzkrieg Bop by the Ramones. All right, I'm going to stop the read aloud again. And look at that. I've got a nice punk rock song. Only three chords should be easy for me to quickly learn and perform. All right, now I want to point out some other things down here. At the bottom of the screen, we can click the chat icon at the bottom left to start a whole new chat conversation on another topic. Off to the right, if I want to switch to text input, I can press the keyboard icon. Next to that, we have a camera icon. And this is nice because we can take a photo of something, upload it here to Copilot, and we can ask questions around it or ask to have the picture revised. So I'm going to click New Chat. Okay, so now I'm going to press the camera icon and take a photo of an image. All right, the image is now dropped into Copilot, and I'm going to ask it the following. Make this guitar look cartoonish and give it a punk rock style. I'll try to create that. Whoa, that's awesome. 
I think I like this one on the bottom right. Here I can save it to my collections. All right. And notice up here at the top left, we can go in and access some other tools in here. We have Copilot, we have Microsoft Designer, Vacation Planner, Cooking Assistant, Fitness Trainer. And down here, we have our historical Copilot chat sessions. At the top right, we have a more menu. In here, we can start a new topic. We also have some plugins we could access, a notebook. We can rename this chat session. We can share it with someone, provide feedback, or delete. All right. And that is how you use Microsoft Copilot on your mobile device. If you liked this video, please let me know in the comments below. Also, if you want to see more of these videos, consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification button so you can be notified every time I post new videos. Also, if you have a specific tech tip you'd like me to create, please let me know by completing the form in the description below. And I'll see you on the next one.